da 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 our first topic our first topic which is going to be looney tunes huh yeah, so I'm going to talk a little bit about Looney Tunes. Uh, so, Looney Tunes. What are Looney Tunes? Well, Looney Tunes is owned by Warner Brothers Studios. And and in the old, 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 old days, uh, uh, movie theaters didn't have many, many, many screens. We didn't have multiplexes. Most movie theaters only had one, maybe two screens. So... That meant that movie times were very limited. During the day is when they showed kids' movies. They didn't show them at night or in the evening or whatever. They, they only showed them during the daytime. And what they would do before every kid's movie is they would show little short cartoons, like, you know, five, maybe ten minutes short cartoons. And Looney Tunes was one of the first ones that they would do. So they would show a Looney Tunes cartoon, which had the adventures of Bugs Bunny, uh, and who was a rabbit who lived in the woods, who was very clever. And sometimes he would wear disguises and he would try to trick the hunters. And he had a friend, Daffy Duck, who is also an animal, a duck, of course, duh, um, uh, Bugs Bunny. Did I say Daffy Duck? I meant Bugs Bunny. So Bugs Bunny and Daffy Duck. So Bugs Bunny was a rabbit. Daffy Duck was a duck. And there were various hunters. Uh, for example, uh, uh, Elmer Fudd. Elmer Fudd was a hunter. Uh, Porky Pig. He was not a hunter, though. He was just a pig. But anyway, he the, the, all of these animals would, would try to trick the hunters and, and get into trouble and make trouble. Um, there, were, there was Wile E. Coyote. And the Roadrunner, these didn't take place in the forest. They took place in, in like, the desert, in the, in the American Southwest. And the wily e. Coyote was trying to catch the Roadrunner. And Roadrunner, who's very, very smart, would, do, uh, would, would make trouble for the, for the Coyote. And the Coyote is also very smart. He would make these inventions that he would use to try to catch the Roadrunner so he could eat. Um, and, and while these were safe stories, safe adventures, you know, the the animals were never caught. Nobody died. But these were also very, very violent. <laughs> these were incredibly violent cartoons. Incredibly violent. Um, yeah, but there wasn't a story. The story was always the same thing. Somebody trying to catch the other person, but the other person was very clever, so they would make trouble. And, uh, yeah, so that was Looney Tunes. And I, I used to watch Looney Tunes with my grandfather when I was real, 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 real little, I know to visit my grandfather uh, and he'd have Looney Tunes on who would watch Looney Tunes together. I don't know how much he really paid attention, but I paid attention, of course. Uh, this was also in the days when every house only had one TV because I'm old. <laughs> 